Hey, Tony here with the Samsung Developer Program. In this video, I'm going to explain a technique called Tap Reveal. Tap Reveal is where you touch different areas of your watch face to show or hide specific things. In this example here, the user can customize the look of the watch face by tapping the heart icon for the heart rate, speedometer for speed, calendar for date, and the lightning bolt for battery level. So how is this done? Well, Galaxy Watch Designer allows you to take an image file and turn it into a button. A button can be used to open apps like the weather app, the alarm clock, battery level, music, or even the phone app. It can also simply change to a different image when tapped. And the secret to the tap reveal button is the second image can be completely transparent. All right, let's get started. The first step is to create your design using programs like Adobe Illustrator and Adobe Photoshop. This will allow you to easily select different layers when exporting your graphics into Galaxy Watch Designer. In addition to creating your button graphics, you'll also need to determine the tap area. If you have tap areas that are small, it may be difficult for the user to touch the exact spot. Because the tap area is determined by the dimensions of the button, what I like to do is make the canvas area of the graphic larger rather than crop to the edge of the pixels. This will increase the actual button area, making it easier for users to tap. Galaxy Watch Designer allows you to import file types like JPEG, GIF, PNG, BMP, and PSDs. In this case, we'll choose PNG, sometimes referred to as PNG files. Pings can be saved without a background, which is called a transparent ping. Once you are done saving the cover graphics for the buttons, you'll also need to make the transparent empty image to be used as the second image that loads when you tap your button. Because Galaxy Watch Designer will adjust the dimensions of the empty image file to fit the space of the cover button, the dimensions are not important. To do so, make a file in Photoshop, add a new layer, delete the background layer, and save your file as a PNG with transparency. When saving image files, I like to establish a naming convention to easily find files later. I'll start with the word button, and in this case, add the word empty to it. This way, all of my button files will appear next to each other alphabetically on my hard drive directory. Once you have named all of your files, it's time to import and program your cover buttons. To import, you can either drag and drop your cover image PNG file onto the Galaxy Watch Designer workspace area, or use the dashboard component button titled image, and then navigate your hard drive to select one of the cover image PNG files from your directory. I often create detailed graphics at twice the size and then reduce them within Galaxy Watch Designer to help maintain the detail. Once you have positioned the cover image, it's time to turn it into a button. Click the drop-down menu in the Properties window and select Set as Button. Then, click the Action tab and change the action to Change Image. Next, click the Circle Plus button to add the empty transparent ping file. This is a good time to name the layer so that you can easily recognize it. I like to use the same name as the file name. Finish importing your cover graphics, programming them as buttons, setting the action to swap with the empty PNG, and name all of the layers. Because the new images are positioned above all of the other layers, you might need to move the cover image layer down so that it does not appear above certain elements such as the watch hands. Once you are done placing the cover buttons, you can test the functionality by using the run feature within Galaxy Watch Designer. This is also a good way to make sure nothing peeks out from behind the cover graphics. You might find that the heart rate numbers are too wide when it shows a triple digit. All you have to do to test is to change the value of the data within the run window. Here's another one of my designs where I give the user the ability to really customize the look. In this design, you can tap reveal lots of different things like the remaining battery power, day of the week, what month it is, the numeric day of the month, double tap to show the digital time, heart rate, and current speed, continue to double tap to change the overall color, and to customize even further, you can tap the analog clock numbers to turn them off for a really clean design. That's it for now. If you'd like to read my blog on the tap reveal technique, click the link in the description below titled How to Create a Tap Reveal Button to Show Hidden Data. All right, thanks for watching, and for more information on the Samsung Developer Program, just visit program.developer.samsung.com.